Hello and welcome to Wildlife Camp. The waterhole was fairly quiet this week, but luckily we had some little creatures coming to the pond. These are Matabele ants, often also called army ants. And this little army is just returning from raiding a colony of termites. You can see some of them in their jaws they have little kind of orangey pale things, those are termites. Termites are very small. So they will head off on the march to find a colony of termites, they will grab a bunch and then they go home with their loot. about to catch a moth. And here's our water scorpion again. Now believe it or not they do fly. You don't see them but they're there ready to land on your face. I've never had a water scorpion land on my face before but it is possible. This is a spider hunting wasp flying around getting ready to drink. If the spider is too big for them to move efficiently, they'll bite its legs off and then drag it off and stick it in a burrow and lay their eggs inside it. Only six video clips on the trail camera since Sunday, but this one was a good one. There was a female in the beginning that just walked past the front of the camera and the male in the background. And one of our tilapia fish just near the tadpoles. And they've settled in quite well. It took them a while, but they seem to be growing and thriving and keeping the mosquitoes down. And there are thousands of tadpoles in there. It's a very good crop. Hopefully they'll survive and leave and replenish the toad population that was decimated by the giant eagle owl last summer. The lions killed a zebra during the night maybe half a kilometer from us and it looks like the pride had split up there were eight of them so the smaller cubs weren't around unfortunately so they missed out on a feast and this is one of the young males most likely the one that came so close to the camera on sunday's video Always going to be a jackal or two lurking around in these situations. They're quite happy to go quite close to the lions, especially once the lions have already had a lot to eat and they, they're not going to be too enthusiastic about running off after jackals.
female was surprisingly submissive in this situation, considering that she's bigger and meaner than the young male. Seems that the lions have been following the zebra around. When it was so dry, the zebra had moved off into a different area, so we hardly saw the lions, and now that it's rained and the floodplains are green again, the zebras are back and so are the lions. Some double banded sand grass in the bottom left, and the giraffe are not drinking too much lately. They seem to be getting most of their moisture from the leaves. Thanks for watching.